Hey, welcome to my channel. My name is XD. So last year I made a lot of music and I've been meaning to release a lot of that music this year. I wanted to find a way that I could master my music really quickly like that. So I've been really thinking about Lander. So fortunately they reached out to me and asked if I could try out their mastering. Okay, so I'm on the Lander page right now. This is how it looks. It's got this uh, circle here and you just drag and drop this one here and then I'm gonna drop it there and then there it is. And now it's uploading it. And you can see here it's uploading. You can see the numbers moving here. I like that it actually listens to whatever you give it instead of just like throwing on a preset or something like that. And it's now building a custom chain. Okay, so now preview is completed and you can tell that it actually put in the work to actually listen and then actually work on the track and really do something. So now I can tap on listen and then here it is. Now you, we have this window here and then I think this play button is now here where we can actually demo the master and you can see down here there's a switch between the original and the master and we also have a volume match which is really cool because sometimes you need to have a volume match so that you're not impressed just by the loudness but by the tonality and so that you can really tell what the mastering really added so that's really cool I also I really like that so you have different styles you have warm you have balanced you have open and then you also have loudness settings here if you want low loudness you can pick that medium and high you also have reference so if you come to reference you can upload a master track that you want to use as a reference this is so cool my guy like you can literally upload a reference track so that it kind of works with that and uses that to reference so that it can give you a master that is based off the reference that you feed it i, I gotta respect okay first listen let's listen to this track first okay so this is the original Now the master. I must say I am pretty impressed. So now let's try it with the volume match. Let's see how that works. And we can also try out, let's say, the, the warm style. So what it says here is that the warm gives a vintage warmth with softer compression for thick smooth sound and then the balance is controlled with focus on balance clarity and depth and open it's a modern open sound with emphasis on punch and presence that's really cool i really like that let's try open So let's try check out the loudness level. So I'm going to start with the low. Let's switch to high. Okay, I think I like the medium better. I think I like it on medium and then I think I like the open because it really spreads out the track nicely. All the instruments that I panned, they are really nice, you know, and like extra wide. Something that I would normally do when I'm also doing my own mastering. I like to have my master really nice and wide so that they, you know, give you this openness that they give you like just what the style says. Thank you. 
Wow, I really love the texture that it added to this track. Like it added a lot of punch to the track nicely and it just feels like a whole different energy has been put into the track with this mastering. I am really impressed. So I can say create master and then I can choose the format. Like a wave, I think it's totally fine. It's uncompressed industry standard for distribution. Um, I'm gonna choose that. And then I can say continue and then it's gonna start processing it and then it's gonna give me the whole wave out and if you come here you can also release with lander as well and that's something that they are doing now and you can also download if you want to download the track you can also share and you can also come here move to a folder or rename and, and that kind of thing and if I come here to the cog you can turn you can change this to like uh, dark mode on and off you can also have a compact view and you can also save your mastering preferences so that you have the same mastering style or options selected for all your masters that's a cool thing but i like to you know add a little bit of myself into the mastering there that'll be really cool i don't want all my songs to be treated with the same kind of treatment i want them to be different some songs i want them warm some songs i want them to be open and some i just want normal and depending with my mix i might want the loudness to be different and that kind of thing so right now it's it is mastering it generated a preview and then now it's just mastering and it's that simple there you go now it's done then i can just easily download but you can also ask for a revision if i click here on revision it can revise the master so it says here drill down into the nitty-gritty details of your track with mastering revision fine-tune your eq adjust your loudness protect against sibilance and refine your sound for the perfect final master this is awesome. It's like you're dealing with a human being, but it's AI, bro. Like, I really love this. I really dig this. So you can revise the master. Uh, this is your unrevised master. Changes won't be reflected here in real time. Got it. Okay, so it asks you, how is the loudness, right? So if it's too quiet, you say too quiet, or if it's good. Do you want to enable distortion filter? No or yes. How is the EQ intensity too high or too low? So you're giving it feedback. You give, you're letting it know what you think about the master so that it, it, it revises it and gives you a different master at the end. So it can also adjust the EQ. If the lows are too boomy, if they are too thin, oh, Dude, look at this. If the mids are muddy, if they are weak, if the highs are harsh, dull, if the vocals are nasal, muted, or if they're good. And you can also adjust the sibilance control. How much additional sibilance control would you want to apply? If you want light or heavy, where would you like to control the sibilance? High voices, low voices, or full? And then you can just re revise your master. I think this is really awesome, man. I think this is really awesome. So I'm really impressed with how Lander is working right now. Like I had never really used it before, like in full and really have everything open and checked it out. This really works for music producers that really want to streamline their output and really want to work and put out music. If you want to send your music to labels, if you are independent music producer or, or an artist, you can use Lander to master your music music if you have good mixes you can even have someone mix your music for you and then just use lander to master it after the fact and then you know you can be releasing music on a consistent basis some people make beats nowadays we are in a very competitive industry so having a service like this is really really helpful because it really helps you work fast 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 like this and then you can put out music quickly so that you don't fall behind so i think lander gets like two thumbs up for me I, i'm really gonna be using this for my releases going forward uh you know mixed with my own mastering if i'm feel i'm not really feeling like doing my own mastering i'll just try out lander so that i can have kind of a, a, another master that i can you know try out with my own but anyways thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video i am x and i'm out peace